going to do some introduction to ballet syllabus. Um, this is for students that do the introduction to ballet class. And also nursery students could have a go at this. Also pre-primary ballet could have a go because um, it'll help with their technique and things. Okay, so I'm going to work on five exercises. I'm going to break them down without the music and then I'll put the music on and do them as well. Okay. So foot flex and march. Feet together in first position and arms here. So we've got heels. So we've got heel one, together, two, together, three, together, four, together. Always coming back to first position. Heels together. Okay. From there, we've got marches, high knees, pointy toes. So lift the knee nice and high and point the toe to the floor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then we go back to our heels. One, together, two, together, three, together, four. This time we just do six marches. Swing in the arms, high knees, point to toes. One, two, three, four, five, six. We go clap. Ta-da! This arm goes right up to the ceiling and the other arm out to the side. Lifting the toe up. And that's the end of that one. So that's the foot, 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 flex and march. So point and close is a batman tandu. We do just a nice pointed foot forward and it comes back. Like we're drawing a straight line on the floor with our toe. Pushing forward and coming straight back, okay? You want to come back to first position and start in first position. You want the legs to stay really straight. You've got to suck them up the straw like we say in class and grow tall for the top of your head, tummies in, bottoms in, shoulders down, keep growing to the top of your head, and we push forward, one, close two, keep going, three, close four, keep the inside of the foot, pushing forward, heel on top, and that's all we do for our nice points and closes. Keep growing, no weight on that front foot. Okay, we'll try it with the music. Point and close. position. Demi plies. So again, feet in first position, growing tall and we want to just do some nice bend and stretches. Okay, you want to try and keep flat here. So we don't want to see your bottom sticking out or your tummy coming forward. Remember I say like you're a piece of bread in the toaster and you don't want to get a burnt tummy or a burnt bottom. So pushing your knees out to the side, Growing tall through the top of the head, bend and stretch, making that nice diamond shape. Make a diamond and stretch. Squeeze those legs really tight when you're stretching. Okay, let's try it with music. Two 
sweaties. So we've got a nice teddy bear. So go and find a nice teddy bear if you haven't got one already close by. Feet are in first position and we're going to rock them to sleep. I've got Daisy Doc. Rocking Daisy to sleep. So we hold it tight and we turn do the toe out to the side, pointed to the side. Again, pushing your heel forward, we don't want to see the on top of the foot. Can you see that? Come a bit closer. So the inside of the foot, keeping your hips forward. Don't want to see you twisting. You've got to keep your hips forward, pushing the inside of the foot forward as well. Don't want to see that. Okay. So we've got sways. So we do a nice big demi plie in second position. Again, pushing the thighs back. Demi plie, weight equal between both feet. One, two, transferring the weight to three, four, five, six. Keep pushing the inside of the foot forward, seven, eight. From there, we're taking a turn. So we're going on the tiptoes and we're doing it one turn, quick feet, round we go, and back to first position where we started. Give your baby a kiss goodnight, put her into bed. Hold your skirt, girls, or hands on your hips, boys, and tell your baby to go to sleep with a nice Make sure your feet are in first position behind your baby or dolly or teddy bear, whatever you have. And that's the ending position. Okay, let's try that with the music then. Now. Nah. 